Hello dear friends, welcome back to your own YouTube channel Seven Engineer. Today we are going to learn quantity estimation of all materials like cement, sand, coarse aggregate and steel per circular tight column. So watch the video full and do not forget to like this video. Let's start today's discussion. Today we have selected an example of circular tight column. According to given drawing, the total height of the circular column is 12 feet, the diameter is 18 feet, clear crore provided is 1.5 inches, concrete used is 1 ratio 2 ratio 4. Details of the reinforcement can be obtained by studying this cross section of the column. Here you can see the transverse reinforcement are provided in the palm of number 3 bar circular ties at the rate 6 inches center to center. And longitudinal reinforcement is provided in the form of 8 number 6 bars. As we know that reinforced cement column is composed of concrete and steel. First we will calculate quantity of materials for concrete that is cement, sand and coarse aggregate. And then we are going to calculate quantity of steel for longitudinal reinforcement as well as for transverse reinforcement. To calculate the quantity of concrete, first we will calculate wet volume of concrete. Wet volume of concrete can be obtained by using this simple formula that is area multiplied by height. Is it is given that the column is circular and we know that the cross sectional area of the circular section is equal to pi by 4d square. So the volume will become pi by 4d square multiplied by h that is the total height of the column. Now just put values in this equation we will get wet volume of concrete pi by 4 multiplied by 1.5 square in inches the diameter is given is 18 inches and if you divide it by 12 diameter in feet will be obtained is 1.5 feet then we will multiply this cross sectional area by total height which is 12 feet after simple calculation we will get wet volume of concrete is 21.20 cubic feet this is the wet volume of concrete dry volume of concrete is slightly larger than wet volume of concrete to obtain dry volume of concrete, just multiply wet volume by increasing factor 1.54. So here for the value of wet volume in this equation, we will get dry volume of concrete is 1.54 multiplied by 21.20 cubic feet. After simple calculation, we will get dry volume of concrete is 31.65 cubic feet. Now to find the quantity of each material cement sand and coarse aggregate will follow the following method as we have calculated in previous slide that the total quantity of concrete required for this column is 31.65 cubic feet and it is also given that the ratio of concrete used is 1 ratio 2 ratio 4 now to find the quantity of cement sand and coarse aggregate first we will calculate sum up ratio because we are going to use this sum up ratio in the upcoming equations your sum up ratio will be 1 plus 2 plus 4. It will equal to 7. Now volume of cement can be calculated by using this equation. Volume of cement is equal to cement ratio multiplied by total volume divided by sum up ratio. Now just put values in this equation. We know that cement ratio is 1. Total volume calculated is 31.65 cubic feet. And the sum up ratio is 7. Now just doing simple calculation we will get volume of cement is 4.52 cubic feet. Now to convert this volume into bags, we know that volume of one bag of cement is 1.25 cubic feet. I have already uploaded a video about how volume of one cement bag is equal to 1.25 cubic feet. You can watch that video by clicking this i card or the link given in the description box. Now to find number of bags, just divide this volume of cement by the volume of one cement bag. After simple calculation, we will get 3.63 bags. Now to change this into whole number, we will get four bags. So now you can see that we have calculated the number of bags required for this circular column. That is four bags. Now we will calculate volume of sand required using same equation. That is volume of sand is equal to sand ratio multiplied by total volume divided by sum up ratio. Now just put values in this equation. We know that Ratio of sand is 2, total volume is 31.65 and sum up ratio is 7. After simple calculation we will get volume of fine aggregate or sand required is 9.04 cubic feet which is nearly equal to 
9 cubic feet. Now by using the same method we will calculate volume of coarse aggregate or crust stone. Volume of crust stone will be equal to crust stone ratio multiplied by total volume divided by sum of ratio. Here you can see that ratio of crust stone is 4, total volume is 31.65 and sum of ratio is 7. After simple calculation we will get volume of crust stone is 18.08 cubic feet. Now you can see that we have calculated quantities of material required for concrete for this column that is number of cement bag is 4 bags, sand is 9 cubic feet and coarse aggregate is 18 cubic feet. To avoid lengthy videos, the overall steel work is carried out in the next video. You can access that video by clicking this portion or visiting the link given in the description box. Thank you very much for watching this video fully.